Welcome to the Washington, D.C. Market Watch, brought to you by Real Estate Business Intelligence and MRIS Company. Let's take a quick look at the most recent numbers for housing market activity in the nation's capital. As the national economy started 2011, most economists predicted a continued improving economy as the year progressed. In hindsight, the positive signs evident in early 2011 were not positive enough to overcome the strong headwinds that followed. Many factors buffeted the recovery, severe winter storms, higher gas prices, the European financial roller coaster, and the inability of Congress and the administration to negotiate agreements on national debt and budgets. Given this backdrop, it's indeed fortunate that a double-dip recession did not occur. Now in early 2012, almost all economic measures are pointed in a positive direction, and more strongly so than a year ago. Unemployment is down, gross domestic product is up, corporate earnings are up, and most importantly for the housing market, consumer confidence is on the rise. All of these positive indicators set the stage for continued recovery in the housing market. Pending sales increased 9.3% from January 2011 to a level of 529. This is higher than December and bodes well for the year's beginning and shows evidence of increasing consumer confidence. Perhaps the biggest story in the region's housing market is the declining inventory, which is bringing the supply-demand picture into better balance. Active listings in January were down 27.6% from a year ago. The result? Month's supply of available housing is declining. January's rate of 3.2 months is down 2.2% from December and is in the range that indicates a seller's market. Median home prices have been generally stable, reflecting the improving economic conditions and the increasing balance between supply and demand. The median sale price in January was $375,000, which is a slight decline of 8 tenths of 1% from January 2011. January year-over-year -year sales were essentially flat at minus 1.3%. These trends indicate continued improvement in the fundamentals underlying the housing market, with lower inventories, continued low interest rates, lower rental vacancies, and decreasing unemployment rates, the spring housing market looks to be better than the last few years. That's the Market Watch for this month. Be sure to come back next month for the latest.